And this is Brad. For Get Out There Magazine, and we're about to go ice skating! Yeah! Gearing up with some unique equipment that included knee pads, shin pads, and spiked shoes, we joined the Bada Bada Ice Canoe Team for a training session as they prepared for the annual Montreal Ice Canoe Challenge. Ice canoeing is something I've always wanted to try since learning about it in middle school and recently, fellow Get Out There reporter Brad and I got to experience this unforgettable Quebec tradition. Ice canoeing, you have to row around on the ice and sometimes just push it with one leg on, on the boat and one leg outside of the boat. You are five on the boat, there's four who's actually uh, rowing and there's one who's steering the, steering the boat. Pushing off, we made our way across the frozen St. Lawrence River. Gliding across the ice, we picked up speed as all of us pushed in unison. Eventually, we would reach thin ice and open water. Climbing into the boat, we grabbed the oars and began to row. The large ice canoes are extremely stable, and even with two new-to-the-sport media personnel aboard, we managed to keep upright and on course. When the ice was too thin to walk on, special picks on the edge of the oars allowed us to pick our way along. You're going through an ice cold river uh, in the middle of winter and these people are barely dressed. They're dressed as if they were going cross country skiing. No wetsuits, no dry suits. Uh, they've got spikes under their, uh, their feet and at the end of their oars. Things get a little more challenging when the river is a mixture of loose ice and patches of open water. Ice canoeists have to jump in and out of the boat, depending upon conditions, and may only row or push in short spurts. This adds some excitement, as the paddlers must constantly adapt to the changing river conditions. The fifth person sits in the stern and is responsible for steering the boat. Instead of an oar, they use a canoe paddle with a spiked tip. So we've been doing this event for three years. This is our fourth. It's a great ice canoe race in Montreal on February 20th. And we have quite a great course here because it's practically downtown. So there's a, a bunch of spots you can watch the race from and always feel that you're very close to the action. We've got about 35 teams signed up so far and uh, we might you know, end up getting 40 by the race, but we're happy with that number. We're one race within seven, and it's important to say that all these teams challenge for the uh, end of season honors. They go to every race. There's a whole big community of ice canoers uh, throughout the province. We love to assist anybody who wants to start a team because uh, we think it's, it's a great winter sport. So uh, hopefully by seeing the race in Montreal, uh, people will have that idea and go for it. Did it. Great day on the St. Lawrence River. Ice canoe in Montreal. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. The most intense paddling I've ever done. <laughs>